progressing to reading was pretty hard. Mm -hmm. um, I think my first mistake was trying to take on something too big. I bought like, um, I don't know if it was like a Harry Potter book. I think a lot of people around that time were, were mm -hmm. doing that. Mm -hmm. Like I'm going to read Harry Potter and Japanese thing. And I think I was a little too ambitious and kind of failed at first and then took a step back and then um, started reading like, basically books targeting elementary school students, like novels. There's a series, um, Edo Gaurampo, who's an older Japanese writer. Um, his name comes from um, like Edgar Allan Poe, mm -hmm. but you know, it's Edo Gawa and he writes these mysteries and there's this like um, mystery series called the Shonen Tante Don, like the elementary uh, detective group. And it's a series that's set around like right immediately after World War II, which is um, one of my favorite periods in history. And it's this group of like orphan kids who are like a detective gang. Mm. Uh, it's kind of like a Hardy Boys type thing. And so that one, you know, the um, the kanji that's used there is basically kanji that elementary school kids can read. And anything above that would be written either in hiragana or would have the hurigana. And so since I was able to read elementary school at a level <laughs> Japanese, it was kind of perfect, right? And then once you could, once you know, I got past that point, then you could progress to something a little bit more. Uh, challenging.